Assalamu alaikum warahmatullah. I hope those are watching this video having good health and doing great. And in this video, I am going to explain about BMR. And BMR stands for basal metabolic rate. So, what is BMR? So, as it is rate, so we can say the definition first that the BMR is a rate at which our body uses energy at rest. So, it, it is. It, it's the indications that the energy is required at when we are at resting phase in order to keep our vital functions going like breathing. So we can say that BMR is defined as a rate at which our body uses energy at the time of rest in order to keep our vital functions going like breathing. So how we determine BMR and what exactly it indicates to us. So, as we know that this is BMR, this is basal metabolic rate and this metabolic rate can be determined uh, through a very popular calculation which is called Harris-Benedict popular formula and this is the formula. So, we can say this is Harris-Benedict, Harris-Benedict's popular formula, popular formula. So this formula is used in case of male and female to determine that person's BMR. So you must know one thing that this BMR is indicating the calorie, the amount of energy that it requires by that person or that human beings at the resting phase. So when people are not doing anything, only breathing, keep breathing, and that time our metabolic rate that indicates so how we can determine one person's BMR like in case of male and female you see these equations you might have it in your Google uh, of course in your book also is written that BMR in case of female and in case of male there are slight changes but the type of equations or the formula is pretty similar what is this in case of female, we have to add first 655. So 655, and now we need to use this weight and height. But one thing is important, we have to deduct age. So it means when we have more age, like 60, 70, and 80, or 90, or even 100 years, it means that the BMR will be smaller one, comparatively. In case of young age, because you are deducting the value, in case of young age, the BMR is higher. But in case of when in old age, BMR is slightly or comparatively lower. So you see that 655, weight, height, but height should be in centimeter. Did you remember that when I uploaded class on um, BMI, that is body mass index, the formula was mass of the body in kilogram divided by height in meter. So that height should be meter square, but here this height is in centimeter. So 655 plus weight, that weight should be multiplied by 9.6. So I, I know that some of my students uh, talked about in my Facebook that, well, remembering this formula is sometimes too much difficult. Or, yeah, that, that might be, it's remembering this formula, but what can be done? In case of female, so you must know four, four, four quantitative data, that is 655, that is fixed. So in this case, you know that is, here will be plus, plus, and then this will be minus. So there is three quantitative data that we must know. In case of female, this is 9.6, 1.8, and 4.7. Just remember one thing. Because this is to be multiplied with the body weight, and this is to be multiplied with the height in centimeter, and this is to be multiplied with the year age. So if somebody is 60 years, then 4.7 times 60 years. Okay, so in case of female, think about one thing that is 655, 4.7, 9.6, I mean 9.6 actually previously, 1.8 and then 4.7. Sometimes I also feel like I have to see it again, 
So 9.6.1.8.4.7 is the data that we need to memorize in case of female. But in male, you see the differences is it's only 66 plus it would be 13.7, it would be 5, it would be 6.8. Now you think, can you remember this data before before going to determine someone's BMR? So it's a 655, 9.6, 1.8, 4.7. And this is 66, 30 per 7, 5 and 6.8. So sometimes if you feel this is beneficiary for you to remember, I feel better. Now think how to determine someone's BMR. Think about someone's BMR. We are, we are trying to find it out. If, uh, suppose an athlete or a moderate worker that is working for every day, that age is 45 years of age, or suppose 30 years of age, and uh, 30 years, and his, his body weight is uh, more about like 75 kilogram, and he is uh, 5 feet 11 inches long. So 5 feet 11 inches, 75 kilogram body weight and 30 years of age and he is actually a moderate worker that is working every day and what is suppose every day, every day per week he works. So we have this data. So if somebody's data is like that 30 years of age, 75 kilogram and 5 feet, 5 feet 11 inches and every day. It does work. So what should be the BMR? Now one thing you think that these 30 years is unchanged. Okay, we understand. 75 kilogram, we directly put it here with 75 kilogram. But this 5 feet 11 inches, we need to convert it into centimeter. That's the main point. And in my previous video, when I explained about BMI, I said it earlier that in this case, we need to understand some sort of like unit changes category. Like we know that one feet is 12 inches. One feet is 12 inches. And one thing also that 2.54 centimeter is equal again one inch. Of course, you might know it. And this is one inch. So again, we can say that 100 centimeter is equal to one meter, which is very common. And one thing also remember that if I say that one meter, that is 39.37 inch. These common and very common unit changes we need to remember. In our day-to-day -day life, we must know these calculations or mathematics. So 1 feet, 12 inch. 2.54 centimeter is 1 inch. 100 centimeter is 1 meter, you did it every time. So in case of 1 meter, 39.37 inches. So how do we calculate in case of 5 feet, 8, 11 inches? So as we have 5 feet, so we can multiply by 12 then this is 12 plus 11 so 5 feet 11 inch means 5 times 12 which is 60 plus 11 that is 71 inch okay so 71 inch is the height of this person now we need to convert it into centimeter so we know that 1 inch is 2.54 centimeter so 71 inch is actually 71 times 71 times 2.54 centimeter so it is actually 71 so we can say that 71 times 2.54 that is 180.34 so 180.34 centimeter this person height or we can say this is 1.8 meter in both cases we can say that so somebody's height is given as feet inch but we need to convert it into centimeter and one thing actually we can do it in uh, in uh, calculator if you have a scientific calculator like this suppose uh, i have this one 
uh, so we can use simply that shift 8 so there are some conversions is open from 0, 01 to 40 and in this calculator if you see is the back side it's given that how much times uh, like what is the meaning of 01 to 40 so we want to convert it inchy to centimeter or feet to meter meter to feet so 01 to 04 is our focus so if we can use it as 01 so we see that inchy to centimeter is given so if I say that okay in case of this uh, in case of inches so we can say that okay 2 shift 8 0 2 this is shift 8 0 2 this is centimeter to inch so we can say 1 centimeter is equal 0 0.39 inch or even we can say the shift 8 0 3 we got feet to meter so one feet is equal to 0 0.3 meter so similarly we also can use other functions here to to find it easily conversations i mean this is very easy which in, in your scientific calculator is given so now think about this person be mind. removing this one okay so 180.34 centimeter this is the person's 180.34 so as this person is male so the BMR would be 66 plus 13.7 times 75 plus 5 into 180.34 minus 6.8 times 30 so I hope you understand definitely that 66 times 13 by 7 into weight in kilogram 5 into height in centimeter minus 6.8 into 30 as it is a male. So now we can use and again calculator so we see that 66 plus 13.7 times 75 plus 5 times 180.34 minus 6.8 times 30 that is together 17.791 so this is 1791.2 calorie but in the question it was asked that that person works every day so when he works week per week every day we need to multiply that BMR with 1.725 so that is times 1.725 which is 3089 3089.2 calorie so is actually 82 calories so if this person wants to be uh, keep healthy then this person need per day at least 3100 calorie amount of food per 24 hours and that is the calculations of Harry's Benedict formula why we need to multiply it you see there is a chart and this chart if somebody's is life is very lethargic and doing nothing and then that person's BMR should be multiplied by 1.2 to, to keep the, uh, the calorie intake per day but the person is light working then to multiply by 1.375 a much like moderate worker then we need to multiply by 1.5 if again every day every day it has worked then we need to multiply by 1.725 but in case of athletes or those people are really hard working doing a lot of work a day then I think uh, the BMR should be multiplied by 1.9 or 2 because the calorie intake of that person should be so high as because that he or she is hard working. So al calorie intake or the uh, calorie demand is so high comparatively than the other person. Those are working hard. So I hope you can use this 
Harris Benedict formula, whatever you are. So the main main thing is that when in your questions is given someone's personal data like that is the body weight, height, and uh, the year's age, you need to multiply. If this is given centimeter, fine, use it. But if given feet and inches data, then use it to to think about. Uh, how to convert to inches to centimeter or inches to meter or feet to inches so that is very important and do not make any mistake in case of calculation otherwise it's a mathematical value it might come wrong if you do any mistake but here put minus some of you may have some problems with using plus everywhere and some of you face trouble to memorize this data like me that 13.7 5 and 6.8 so we use this formula because that person is a male but if this person is female then use it so I hope you understand this formula and again I hope that you will do it in your own way so that you can calculate the BMR and do let me know in the comment sections if you don't find anything good or if you find anything troublesome or if you face any problem in your study regarding PMR calculations or whatever do let me know in the comment section so I'll definitely come with the next video adjusting your demand hopefully so see you on the next class stay well stay blessed bye